Hi, Kim. Can we get some yo's? Hello. How am I? I'm doing good. I think my voice is like 99% back. And Stars in Time really did set me back a bit. It was a good game though, I know. I kinda wanna go back and play it again, like in my own time. But I didn't say this when I actually beat the game. That should be over by now, I think. But me going back and trying to like get every single item that you could pick up for the final ending would not have worked. Because the true ending, spoilers, is where Sifrin like has to do it by themselves so they don't get any items. That to me was crazy. Also, face came out in one minute, not even kidding. I, does the game sound like at a good level compared to me? Or should I bump it down like two notches again? I think it's fine. But like the game is supposed to be like loud as shit. It's supposed to blow out your eardrums. I like the music. Not for the next four hours. <laughs> no, I'm not playing this shit for four hours. <laughs> okay, I'm deleting that. I'm deleting that. I <laughs> deal mio. You don't have the internet for a day tooth and you lose your mind. But you said it. I only said one of those words, not the other three together. Anyway, three, two, one. Guys, the goat is back. Hello? I'll bump down the music like two notches, and then we'll, we'll bump it back up whenever we're like actually playing. There we go. Hello, good morning. Hope everyone is doing well today. It is Saturday, August 31st. I dead ass thought September 1st was Saturday. But it's Saturday, August 31st. So, it's still August, <laughs> which it doesn't really matter. But guys, if somebody wants to become the new top gifter and wants to usurp Kim, do it. Do it. Okay, matching, I see you. Matching what? Huh? Huh? Anyway. We had Kim and Tooth in the starting soon screen. Welcome in, guys. Hello. Uh, today, the plan is simple. Did I stream yesterday? Oh, yeah, I didn't stream yesterday. Peace and light, people cried. Because I'm not hanging out with my friends this weekend. Because we forgot it was holiday. And whenever you go out on holiday weekend, service is bad. The bus routes don't run as much. Oh, the skirt and the scrunchie. Oh, okay. I mean, I tried. I tried. You know, I, I dollied up today. Also, I'm live late. It's 11.24. Because my sister, uh, she's off this weekend. So we were hanging out a little bit for, before I stream. Um, and she's like, Peace, I really want to get your black kids. I'm like, fine. It's been like a month. You can have some fun. So she goes straight for my nose. So for, for like 30 minutes, I wish I took a picture. My nose was bright red she was calling me rudolph <laughs> and because she asked me before she's like did you stream yet today peason and i'm like no and she's like okay and she just goes for it and she's like and then when she was halfway through she's like are you gonna stream later i'm like yeah and she's like oh no and then she told me to go in the bathroom and my nose was so red <laughs> so that's why i'm late it took like 30 minutes for it to like get back to it's still like a little bit pink but this is a sunburn right here and it keeps getting agitated because where my glasses line up so yeah 
We put aloe on it and it was fine. Love being in the Pieces Sisters fan club? Don't worry, she'll make a VTuber one day. Surely. Her stories are so iconic. I just tell you guys the good ones. I just tell you guys the good ones. Nah, she's pretty chill. Let me just say, I am allowed to yell today, but she's going to sleep soon. We're gonna get lit later, and by that, we're gonna get ice cream later. Maybe, I don't know. But yeah, I just tell you guys the good stories. She's like, how do I say? She's like 90% normal and then 10% funny. And then like point point zero 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 one annoying. Rum and raisin? Ew, alcohol, and also raisins? Just eat a grape. Just eat a grape. Raisins and any type of dried fruit are so much worse for you because you're not getting all the same nutrients as you would as fresh fruit. And also since dried fruit is like smaller and more condensed sugar, you're more likely to eat a fuck ton of raisins than a bushel of grapes. So your sugar levels to the moon. L <laughs> nutrients, W sugar. Exactly. Okay guys, the plan is simple. Wait, I forgot, I forgot. Um, Peace and light, people cried. No new artwork out yesterday because I forgot that um, post offices will be closed on Monday. So I was like, you know what? I'll delay it till next Friday. But you know what? Wait, where is it? New artwork available on the website this next Friday. I promise. I have all the supplies. I just have to take pictures and stuff. I'm not going to leak what it is. If you know, you know. But anyway, all the paintings you see back here are my own work. If you want me, if you want your own painting, I will paint it live on stream just for you. I also have Lino block prints available. There are color and black and white versions. So if you want to color yourself at home, you can get the whole collection or singles where you have a 10% chance of getting a hollow. Ain't no way. So guys, bookmark my website today. Do it now. For real, I was waiting. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, but legit, that, that's the reason why. I was like, shit, I can't mail things out till Monday and that's going to piss me off. Ask me anything. What's the favorite? What's your favorite painting you've ever done? And, okay. Visually, I think this one... I like this one the most. Because I think this one would look good in, like, an office space. It's also... I like it because, like, the lines are supposed to be straight and they're pretty straight, unlike me. But, objectively... I think the prettiest... I have four more, they're just not hung up. I still think it's this one. I think this one looks the best. That one goes crazy, but it's a pain in the ass to paint. It's really hard to get clean lines. So the painting's not an ally, no. You know, not everyone can be gay, just like how not everybody can be straight. We need a little bit of um, affirmative action. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> can confirm it looks great in person i i was thinking about this the other day there's so many people who do physical artwork and then sell prints which is fine but nothing will compare to like getting a physical piece of artwork nothing compares and i know if i were to collect somebody's art i would prefer handmade originals as well obviously you need the money to do so but it nothing compares nothing compares because you know anybody can make a print and if you sell prints it's so much easier for people to scalp it you know what i mean but as long as i keep continuing to offer replicas of originals then nobody can scalp it mac and i got a whole peace museum going on not legit if I, whenever I open my gallery, I'll just borrow it from you guys. <laughs> or you guys can open the gallery for me. Okay, I'm trying to think. Is there anything else? Oh yeah, yesterday I published or I edited the video that went up today. Guys, new YouTube video. Click the link. Go watch it later. I turned 25 to my personality change. This is a highlight edit from the stream from this past 
Monday or Tuesday, was it? Also, Stream Elements does not have a subscription, but, but, you guys know what time of year it is. It is September. Even though it's August, September started early this year. So, now is the time to subscribe. All new tier ones, if you want to extend your subscription to three, six, nine months, or a year long, you get a discount. I don't know what the number is, but reminder, you do have to subscribe on desktop to get these exclusive offers. It's all month long, so you got a couple weeks to think about it. I think you used the discount last year, Kim, but the link I just put in chat and which is also in the pin chat is for the Twitch, Twitter's like support, which has an infographic of all the different discounts they have this year. So yeah, September starts today. Guys, nobody gave Stream Elements a sub. I'm going to do that later and redeem the gift Stream Elements a six month sub. So I'll save like five bucks. I got it on six months auto. W. I was, <laughs> I was going to say, you know, you guys should subscribe for like three months or like six months because I know you guys are going to stick around. But then what if I quit? Imagine me sipping from a teacup. Oh my god, I need to get a- I said in the past I want to implement more like physical bits. Like remember the stress ball? I had it, but then it broke because I squeezed it too much. I want to- I want to get a little saucer and a teacup. <laughs> oh my god, that would be so funny. That would be good. I'm sending you a Venmo request? You think I have money to send you? I literally, for today's stream, I I decided to buy the VIP version of Dress to Impress, and it's $3 for a month, or you can buy it for forever for $9. But it, in order for you to buy the in-game currency, you have to spend $5. So $5 is a third of my assets right now, so now I got $12 instead of $17. Oh, I would bend me if you quit streaming. Oh, okay, I get the joke now. That was good. You know, I think one of the funner parts about live streaming is being able to like goof and gaff with live viewers, but you definitely, there's always disconnect. <laughs> like nothing will compare to like an actual improv setup. You know what I mean? Okay, are we ready to start? Now, this is not a blind playthrough. I did play a little, little, little bit earlier this morning. And let me just say, this is my first time ever playing Roblox. And it is such a baby game. It, it genuinely is. Now, I played for like 20 minutes earlier just to just to like practice and learn the controls and like learn which buttons to not press to leak. And let me just say, the game is kind of boring. <laughs> just to impress with Queso. One day we'll make it happen. I love watching Queso. I watch him most every night. I for sure watch his YouTube though. I've said this many times, the reason why Queso is so successful is because his YouTube videos are literally just like the stream. His editors do very minimal trimming. They don't do any After Effects or VFX. So if you watch Queso's YouTube, you will love his stream. Because his stream is just like his YouTube. It makes so much sense. Anyway. Queso is my goat. One day we'll make it happen. Guys, nominate Peace in for Hidden Gem. 2024, we need it this year. Oh, wait, did I get kicked from the game? I got kicked from the game because I, <laughs> I, I had the game open just to play the music and it kicked me because I didn't move. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Oopsie. Oopsie. Okay. <laughs> I guess I have to move. I am playing on my PC, so if the stream Fs, that's why. You know. My Alienware M17 can only hold so much for handle and hold. Okay, are we ready? You know the drill? Say hi YouTube, this will be an edit. So you guys better behave today. 
You guys know the drill. Say hi, YouTube. <laughs> I also didn't post for thumbnails, so I have to like pog when I'm playing the game now. Okay. Dress. Okay, sorry. Let me reset. The Roblox game Dress to Impress has taken over the internet the past few months, and I've spent so much time stalling and not playing it. Because I promised myself I would never play a baby game. But today, I'm gonna dip my little toesies in and play a bit of Dress to Impress. But I'm gonna play it a little bit differently. I'm gonna be trying to play it entirely wrong. Because today... What's the T? I don't know. Um, your mom. Okay, wait, I gotta, I gotta find the layer. <laughs> Sorry, I opened my mouth without saying anything. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, sir, I can't. I can't. Okay. Today, I'm gonna be playing the game a little bit differently. I'm gonna be trying to play. Wait, fuck. I'm gonna. Today, I'm gonna play it a bit differently. Okay. So, I need to write out my scripts, but I don't. I kind of like just, you know, riffing it. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna be playing the game entirely wrong today because I prepared. A wheel that has all different types of clothing items, dresses, tops, accessories, jewelry, etc. And for every single round, I spin the wheel and whatever it lands on, I'm not allowed to use for one single round. So for example, if this were a game, it landed on, okay, nothing. <laughs> so, okay, well, that would mean there would be no restrictions, but let's say it landed on no top. I would not allow be, I would not allow it to be used Let's say it landed on top. I would not be able to use any tops for that round. So I'm going to try my best to get a win with these restrictions. I knew you were old, but not that you invented the wheel. This is not my IP, sorry. Okay. <laughs> so that's the plan. Okay. This video was recorded live over on twitch.tv slash peace and underscore 17. So make sure you go over there and follow. You can hang out during the stream and... <laughs> and <laughs> sorry. Make sure to go. So make sure to go follow so you can hang out during the stream and watch these videos early. But thank you. Let's go ahead and jump into it. Okay, I'm locked in. Oh, well. This is awkward. Uh. <laughs> okay, we'll jump in the next round. Because I think I still need to get my, like, my flesh tone on my character. Because I didn't know... Because I never played this game. It takes like 30 seconds to get your flesh tone and your makeup done. Which objectively makes sense. Like it contributes to my immersion. But the rounds are timed. Okay, what was the theme? I think it was khaki. Oh yeah, right here. Khaki. I also have chat disabled. So you guys can't say shit. And if you snap me, you'll get banned. I think we'll try this run for like an hour or two. Stream ends when I get a win. Wait, no, I don't want to say that. I don't want to... I do not want to commit to that. <laughs> Wait, I'm not even voting. I'm, I'm such a... I'm like... An undecided voter. Wait, this is kind of crazy. The leather against the khaki? You're not supposed to do that, but it's kind of... It's kind of cool. What's the meta? Those who are further from the theme win? No, I think you do have to be kind of on theme, but something that I do see people, see people do is they'll type their explanations and kind of their spiel for their outfit in the chat. But I can't see that because I don't have chat enabled. Like, you're literally not wearing anything khaki. It's kind of hacky and tacky, so that's a one from me. This one was cool. It has the most texture to it. Oh, you can't see my cursor. Good. <laughs> Zero. 
Maybe they don't know what khaki is. Oh, that is true. And I, okay, I do have the right to look up what themes are if I don't know what they are. I do have my phone ready. And yes, I have two phones. I wish I could, could submit themes, but I can't. Okay, so depending, I think for the first round, I'll just focus on getting my flesh tone and my makeup done. Twitch money? No, I'll be honest. August paycheck for Twitch is gonna go crazy, but to be fully transparent, it's not enough to pay for the $300 flight to Hawaii, so... We are still in the hole, guys. Subscribe with Prime right now. I saw the phone I wanted to buy the other day. Only $100? What? Are you sure we forgot to add a zero? $100 is crazy. Casual? Okay, I can totally do casual. I'm gonna- I'm gonna do it. First round. What can I not wear? No accessories? Cool, because I don't wear accessories anyway. That's honestly a baller first spin. Okay, I'm locking in. I'm doing this round. I'm doing it. I should do my flesh tone first. I don't like being plastic. Makes me feel so fake. And for flesh tone, I'm just going to do one that matches my actual skin tone. I wish I could get out of the tanning booth earlier. Like, come on, let me go. Casual gamer view like? Okay. I think I also want to get some, like, neutral makeup on. Oh, I don't have hair. Um. This kind of looks like mine. Wait, actually, I do have a ponytail today. We'll do that. My hair is, like, almost black, but let's make it a little bit brown so you can see the highlights a bit better. Yeah, this is good. This isn't- because I have really tight coils, but this is as close as we're gonna get. Okay, now I have, I have three minutes. I, I don't need makeup yet. It's fine, it's fine. No accessories, so that means no purse, no jewelry, no nothing. What would I wear normally? Never a crop top, that's only for when I hang out with my sugar daddy. Um, I don't- wait, I can't put that on? Why? Wait, what? Can't be put on? Why can't I put pants on? What? Okay, I don't like sweatshirts, to be frank. I'll be honest, when I'm walking around the house, <laughs> I just got tank tops on. Oh, oh, is this because this is the boy section? I, why can't I wear boy clothes? I literally always wear men's clothing. Okay, well, fine. Halter top kind of goes crazy, but it's not necessarily casual. Cancel Roblox? No, for real, they're anti-woke. No accessories, so that means- is it Shoes are not an accessory, right? They can't. Okay, casual. I usually don't wear denim, though. They should let me make my model, like, thicker. You know, I want it to look like me. Oh, here we go. This is casual wear. Sorry, I have to, like, lo <laughs> lean in to fit on my screen. <laughs> or not to fit, but, like, you know what I mean. <laughs> Yeah, this is me on the weekend. Listening to the weekend. Are there really no sweatpants? One thing that I did notice earlier is that there's not a lot of options in-game on what to wear. <laughs> Sorry, wait, I just realized I have no shoes on. <laughs> no, like, walking around the clothing store with no shoes on is so disgusting. I see people do it all the time in, like, shoe stores or when they're when they're in the dressing room, like, honey, what are you doing? Yes, clunky sneakers. I would never wear, because 
you know what I'll say they're kind of ugly I paid the three dollars to get VIP let's pick something from here wait do the they don't mean business casual right they can't Also, this is really hard for me to control. I usually don't do WA Steam games. Yeah, this is like the most- oh, Wait, wait, kind of a full denim fit? Wait... Wait, I clicked out of the sweatshirt. Get out of the way! That's kind of crazy. I like- Wait, no, this one. No, that- Wait, the clipping looks kind of good, but... I don't like it. The The circle is lined up in a really questionable spot. We're gonna put that back. This is a baby game, anyway. <laughs> That's insane! <laughs> Sorry, this is not the- I have 13 seconds! Um... Um, choose something normal. Wait, that's cute. Okay, look, I scanned them. Makeup in five seconds. Easy. The theme was casual. Why are you wearing your diamonds and your pearls on a casual outing? I don't... I can see how, like, the... Wait, I didn't vote. <laughs> I'm such a jerk! <laughs> okay, this is not casual. This is like, I'm going to hang out with my girlfriends. This is not casual. Also, hi, Electra. Can we get some yos? Hello. She's she Chapel Roan? That's not casual, though. I know that's what they were going for. Oh, she has a song called Casual? Oh. Four, because they have headphones just like me. I don't keep up with pop culture. Oh my god, it's me! Okay. So I did favorite some poses. Of course, I gotta go with pose number 17 because it is my favorite. <laughs> okay. Slay! <laughs> am I voting? I think I am. I don't know if I'm doing it right. You're winning? Thank you. Pink jeans kind of go crazy. I kind of like that. Basics? Honestly, I love just basic looks. Top three or we're leaving? No, we'll ride if I don't get top three. Also, I totally forgot that I can change the color of the items that I pick. This looks like Regina George. I like it, though. No, honestly, I love it. I'm a sucker for pastel fits. I could never wear it. I don't think it looks good with my skin tone. Dang, those are so... I, wait, can I... I think those are just, like, tights. I don't think those are leggings. Let's give it a four. Of course they have their iPhone. I said that funny. <laughs> uh, this, is, this is like a business casual, but not- I'm gonna give it a two because it's still like, they're cute. But that's not casual, that's like- You're dressing up a bit for the office. Voting complete, okay. Am I gonna get a win on my first try? New rank? Rising star, okay. No! How did business casual win? I got sixth place. Okay, granted, my fit was really boring. <laughs> yeah, that's... <laughs> that's boring. <laughs> Should we do predictions? Let's do predictions for every race. Okay, so now we're in between a new round. 
Time to spin that wheel. What will be banned this upcoming round? No jewelry, easy. I don't wear jewelry anyways, so that's chill. That's chill. Because anytime I wore jewelry, I would always get like colored lines on my skin and that was kind of gross. Okay, let's get rid of my clothing for now. I find it easiest whenever you reset between rounds, that way you don't waste time. Theme witch. No jewelry? That should be totally fine. This will be easy peasy lemon squeezy. <gasps> Wait, I can change my skin tone to like crazy colors, I think. I'm doing that first. Is it the new Wicked? Oh my god, the new Wicked movie is coming out too. I might see it. There we go. <laughs> Wait, they're all doing the same thing. No. No. Okay, witch fit. I'm going straight to the VIP room. A witch? Yeah, a witch would not have wings. I feel like a witch would have something long and plumy, which would be counterintuitive because if they had long poofy sleeves and it would fall in their cauldron, Ooh. Wait. This kind of crazy. You bought VIP? Yes, it was $3. Guys, can we get some primers? Thank you. A witch would not have an umbrella. Would witches have wands? No, that's fairies. Wait, no, because there's... There's the Wicked Witch, and then there's the Nice Witch. They would definitely have a boa. You need a hat for sure. You know, I, I really wanted to wait till Halloween to play this game, but I couldn't wait, I'll be honest. Yes! No, they have the same shit as me! This is so unfair. You know what this means? Great minds think alike. No jewelry, no jewelry. I'm hoping somebody does Bayonetta. Is she a witch? I don't know any of the lore. Okay, I definitely need some type of bottom. It is canon? Okay, I learned something today. Remember when everybody was raving about the strawberry dress? I was gonna buy one, but I don't like long dresses like that. I kind of want to look like a... Anyway. Okay, I need, I need bottoms. Wait, I feel like li maybe layering this. Oh, that clips. That does not look good. What if I change the color? No, that looks ugly. Boots, of course. Wait, honestly? I kind of hate the boa now. But I like how it adds a little bit more texture, you know what I mean? Make it white? No! Or the boa white? Wait. Or maybe I should make it like a brown so it's kind of like animal fur? Because witches are evil, right? I think they would be like... Wait, how do I change the outer part? Oh, you can change the inner section, too. I went to art school. That doesn't mean I'm good at color picking. I kind of like that off-white. I don't know. Okay, I think I think that's fine. That's fine. I only have a minute left. Should I wear gloves? Oh wait! Oh yeah, there was no jewelry for this one. I thought we were still in no accessories. No, I don't like the gloves. We already have texture from the boa. There has 
has to be a wand or something. I, w I do wish they had more, like, weird accessories. Oh, pom-pom, that's cute. The pom-poms pom -poms could be, like, flames coming out. No jewelry. Okay, well, this is all jewelry. No. That is not a good silhouette with a boa. Mm -mm. Because I'm not necessarily too fashionable, but with anything, you have to think about your silhouette and your shape. Especially if you have, like, a thinner build. I think those individuals... How did they get the witch's hat? Is that a crown? No, that's a witch hat. No, it's... Is that a crown? I saw a crown somewhere. No, no, there's is so much better. I suck at this game. Why am I going first? Oh my god, wait, look at my nails. <laughs> okay, I think I... What is this? It's... The fuchsia is too bright. That's still a one. The black? No. Not a good palette. You either have to do all one color or a homogenous palette okay that looks like a nightgown i kind of oh, stop moving they're they're taunting too much yeah the big poofy oh, wait i didn't even roll i'm so bad <laughs> the poofy pants on the bottom wasn't it see this person tried to make a more unique silhouette but the problem is it looks like those you know those strawberry candies dipped in sugar just like strawberry on top of strawberry. It's not a good silhouette. I see what they're trying to do with the clipping, but it's not it. I'm gonna see a two, cause the silhouette of the dress is nice, the hair is cool, but the green, it's giving Monster High? No, literally. Ah, uh, this is the per- Oh my god, look at their nails! Holy, I love this. And the way they clip the hat, that is so good. I know the dress hard carries, but I'm more impressed with the hat. They're gonna win, for sure. Last but not least, this is another one where they layer two dresses on top of each other. See, this silhouette is nicer. I don't necessarily like the red or the purple. I think it would have been cool if it was maybe a white. But the silhouette, it plumes and then it has like the, the shape of the leg and then it plumes again on the bottom. Top five. Okay. You know, this game is so haggy because like it's all little babies playing. So everybody chooses just those in dresses. That's why, like, it's so scam sometimes. I tried to be original with the boa. I was going for a modern witch. You know, wicked. But you know, it's fine. Reroll, let's go again. Stream ends when I get a- No, I'm not gonna say that. I'll try and get top three. You know, can somebody snipe my lobby and vote for me five stars, please? Thank you. Oh, no tops? Oh, that's, that's fine. That's, that's manageable. I would just have to either wear coats or dresses. No top is fine. Uh, no, I, in game. Please wear clothing in public. <laughs> Stream ends when I got, when I get top three. That would be insane if I committed to that. Theme is school. No tops at school? <gasps> I mean, have you guys seen the kids nowadays? I remember my first day of high school. 
legit one of the girls was walking around this was at the end of the day so this girl went the whole day at school walking around like this she wore shorts and they were long enough but whenever she walked you could see straight up her ass cheeks it was crazy and honestly you can't blame me for looking girl get moving i was stuck in the dining bed okay school what would i wear to school honestly this is so 2010s i would wear this i think i had this but in blue no i you can't be showing your tummy at school you're gonna get dress coded wait i the way i just realized the pink thing is literally a crop top i'm not gonna wear that oh wait that's cute that's so cute wait no tops you're right oh no Oh wait, no tops. I totally forgot. <laughs> Man, what would I do without Chad? Okay, well, no tops. That takes away a lot. Backpack, of course. An apple, because we're going to riz our teacher. A sp I was going to say a sports ball. A sock. Wait. Why am I holding it like that? No, I don't like the soccer ball. Let's be honest, I was more of a tennis girly. Ooh, that's kind of cool how I'm- that pose? Okay. No tops, bro. Wait, no. I keep on looking at the tops. This is actually going to be hard. I'm trying to find something that I would actually wear at school. A sweatshirt is still a top. Grr. I would wear the skinniest jeans I could find. Because... I didn't like baggy jeans because I hated the way they felt. I loved a light denim. You know, some of the girls pull up like this to school, I swear to God. It's over for you, I feel. No! I'm looking at the prediction. 20k in doubt. You guys are literally so mean. That was me. Flush. Hats were allowed at my high school and I, saw th I thought that was pretty cool. I remember middle school, you would get, like, banned for the day if you wore a hat, but at high school, you could wear a hat, and it was chill. Clunky shoes, because those are trendy. I would never wear those, though. Okay, how am I gonna get past the no-top regulation? <laughs> Sorry, that sentence is crazy. Headphones, of course. I need headphones. Oh, wait, I had the dingiest headphones. And I think they were black, but let's make them red. Because I want to try and stand out. I got those beats by Dre. Layer dress, that's what I was thinking. I got two minutes. Is this a coat? No, that that's, that's not a coat. I think that's like a sweater. That counts as a top, but... Wait, can I wear my boyfriend's shirt? Wait, that's a top! <laughs> Literally everything! I can't put- Why can't I put on the boy clothes? Oh wait, I have no money! <laughs> yeah, I want the boyfriend jacket. Oh wait, 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 this. This. That looks ugly. But that is like so 2010s though. You know, I'll keep it on for now. The buckles being gold is too much. It needs to be silver buckles. Oh, that's those are tops. I can't wear those. I feel like I could win. Ooh, a coat? Wait. I'll be honest. There were a few days where I went to school and didn't wear, like, like anything besides, like, underwear under my sweater. 
This is not a top, this is technically a coat. So this works, this is allowed. There was one time, <laughs> there was one time I wore like a sweatshirt that had a, that had a zipper and I only wore a bra that day. And my friend, he came up to me because the running joke he would do is he would like zip down my coat and that would be funny, but then I would do it back to him. But <laughs> of course that day I wasn't wearing a tank top. So I was like, don't you dare. <laughs> and he stopped, he got to like here. Why it's me? Oh my god, you can literally see the bra underneath. Um, slay. <laughs> look at me. Wait, can I can I turn to the side? Don't don't look at. Yeah. This is what somebody would wear to school, though. This bright corally pink. I think it's it's good, but. The red is too much. It's too much. It's clipping too much. I kind of hate it. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to say three. Did I even vote? <laughs> I'm too focused on judging, I'm not voting. Wait, where are people getting these books? Now, I don't know how to say this nicely. This looks like a fit you would see in a... Oh my god. In a, like, video that's that has school characters in it. You know what I mean? But, like, not a kid's video. Wait, this is so cute. I love this. It's so cute. This is not practical at all, but it's adorable. I kind of love and hate having uniforms at school. Okay, I'll say it. I'm a sucker for like the checkered shorts or the checkered skirts. I'm a sucker. This is very similar to the other one. They just didn't do it as good. So I'm going to give it a four. Girl, you're gonna be sent home for that crop top. Wait, they have piercings. <laughs> um, it's cute. I'm gonna give it two, but you would get sent home and expelled for this outfit at school. It's giving college? Yeah, this is not school. Another crop top, and they got their belly button pierced. Girl, you can't, you can't wear that to school. I love freedom of speech, but... There's- okay. Euphoria High School? Yeah. <laughs> like, I can understand wearing what you want to wear, but like... You don't know, like, who's gonna be looking at you, you know what I mean? This is cute, but girl, you can't wear that at school. <laughs> like, there's so many teachers who are predators. So it's kind of like, just don't. Just don't. Okay, please. Give me top three. This one, I got seven again. Girl, the person who got third right here, that is not look good. It's clipping so much. Whatever. You know, I'm the only one who's being real and authentic here. Oh, wait, I just realized I had so many accessories on. <laughs> Okay, let's see what I can also not wear for this next round. Don't give me top again. No restrictions? I can do whatever I want. Hell yeah, brother. Okay, I'm locking in. Why do people always wipe their hair too? There's not enough time to get your hair done. Fairy. Fairy caution. Now this is the only appropriate time to use the fairy wings. I swear some people will use the fairy wings just to win. Okay, fairy costume. I don't have to actually look like a fairy. 
Oh, wait, wait, wait. Th there were these flowery shoes over here. Yes, this is the only time where it's fine to wear these shoes. Wait, I kind of... What are those fairy dolls they had back in the day? I swear. They had this type of top. More of a periwinkle. Man, everybody who does not have VIP is totally gonna lose this round. Imagine not having fairy wings for the fairy wing. For the princess, sorry, I can't. Okay, legit, where are the wings? Oh, Aka. I kinda hate those. This is not a masquerade. What if I put both wings on? Wait, that looks kind of crazy. The layering? the green this one yeah the layering is kind of crazy okay I'm locking in if some bimbo wins and they're wearing a dress I'm gonna be so upset you know I can go kind of buck wild with this not me looking at the dress. Wait, it's seven hundred dollars. You know, everybody else is going for Tinkerbell. I'm not gonna do that. There's not many good bottoms. Oh, there is, like, default fairy wings. I think the flowers are too much. I don't know, I'm not an accessories type of person. wings green it kind of looks like a leaf you know of nature okay I hate the color pick <laughs> I'm trying to get the green that matches the shoes Wait, I think I ruined it. No. <laughs> you can copy the color code. Wait, you're so smart. How did I not think of that? Dude, I went to design school. How did I not figure that out? I kind of hate it. I hate it. Hmm. 
We gotta go in there so quick. Okay, I this is giving like a Barbie fairy collab. It's not it's not my best. Why am I always first? I think it's cool how we layer the wings. Trying. Imagine not having VIP and that clipping is ugly. Two stars. I don't like it. It's too sheer. Honestly, I love it. The color palette is nice. The clipping is not ideal. But it's very pleasant to look at. You know, you can obviously tell this person is not a VIP. They did well with what they had. Also, I just realized I didn't do a prediction. Let's do the prediction right now. You know, you just thought you'd win because you had a dress. Two stars. The white stroke on the dress is too much. It stands out too much. I cannot get behind it. This one very similar to the other dress we saw earlier. But I think the skirt is too ballerina, not enough fairy, two stars. Also, the shoes are too bright green compared to the skirt. They struggled like I did with the hex code. Yo, how are they getting the flying animation? <laughs> two stars. The dress, the pink and the green together like that, it looks like circus. Oh, come on, please. Oh, wait, what? Second place? Yo, and I got 17 stars? Wait, I just realized I tied for third. I did it, I actually won. Okay! Yup. Nice! I'm happy with that! Wait, I just realized... I won the round where I had no restrictions. Um... So... I guess that just goes to show you can't win the game by playing the not intended way. Well... <laughs> but I, I do think this fairy fit was good. It had a lot of interesting shapes and silhouettes. I'll take it. A win's a win. I just wanted to get top three, and you know what? I did it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, guys, I know I didn't say stream would end if I got top three, but I think we'll end the YouTube edit here. We'll play for like a little bit more though. Okay. But anyway, let's do the little outro now. And then we'll just play normally for a bit. So that was me playing Dress to Impress for the first time. I got a third place win after less than an hour of playing. I think that just goes to show this game is too easy. And you just have to win over the crowd by wearing wings and a dress. Easy peasy. But thank you for watching. If you want to watch me play games live, you can follow my Twitch, twitch.tv slash peacent underscore 17. But thank you for watching. No, I don't... I might play this game more. Honestly, the only appeal to me playing would be grinding money so I could buy all the clothes. I do wish this game had more in-game assets, though. Like, if they added 
20 more different pieces of clothing, I would be happy with that. Okay, guys. We're an hour in the stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing. For $5.99 to $6. And if you're a new tier 1, you get a discount this month. Ain't no way. You can also link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and subscribe for free. Click subscribe to see if you got that free Prime sub available. Do it now. Well, that was a short YouTube video. Thank fucking God. I actually got top three. I think we'll play for like another 20-30 minutes. Because... I don't know how much else there is to explore in this game. Okay, K-pop. Don't they wear like a lot of... Because they have to wear clothing that f works well when they're dancing. So I feel like a tighter slash looser top. And then like a short pillowy skirt. Yeah, Y2K type B, maybe. Because with their outfits, they have to be practical. Wait, this is kind of crazy. Oh, wait, that is the corset. No, I hate that. <laughs> oh, wait, not screen sharing? Thank you. Omega Dance. <laughs> You know, I've been streaming for three years and I still fuck up. I also feel like a lot of K-pop people wear preppy clothes. Okay, full checkerboard fit kind of goes crazy. I always see them wearing berets. And I don't know if that's cultural appropriation or not. change the patterns what oh that's how people were getting it oh <laughs> they don't clueless wow there's so many i've seen people who make like skins for roblox characters can you make money doing that should i try that Oh, there's genuinely so many patterns. Oh, that's how the person got the checkerboard fit. Oh, because, like, a critique I was going to say earlier is... It feels like every single clothing is so flat. It's because the shading isn't... Like, there, I guess? Okay, this looks like I'm gonna go play tennis. Oh, these are just tights, they're not sheer. Okay, I, I honestly hate tights in real life, too. They always tear. I only got 30 seconds. <laughs> they need to give me more time. Wait, if I pick up the boba, is that, like, bad? I think boba's from... I think it's Taiwan or Vietnam. I think it's Taiwan. Dude, it's so bad. <laughs> You know, when this game was initially- to why am I first? When this game was initially popping off, I would watch streamers play it for hours and hours. I 
I don't get how. I tried my best. The red is too red. Three stars. <clears throat> Wait, I like the top. So cute. I think the leg warmers and the bows are the wrong shades of blue. It would have been better if they were just pure white. If they did white warmers and then the chunky blue and white shoe. Holy! This looks like the person the husband cheats on with in K-dramas. Oh, someone album color cover. We'll give him three because I don't know what they're referencing, but we're going to say it looks good. See, it sucks because the top banner blocks it. Jack something. Jack in the box. Oh, J-Hope. Four stars. You know, we gotta uplift our men. Because they're all very depressed in modern America. <laughs> you know what? I'm a sucker for tops that have the cut up for the upper chest. Uh, I like the little thingies in the hair. Little poofs. I don't know. I remember in elementary kindergarten, they asked everybody, what do you want to be when you grow up? Oh, there was the microphone! They asked everybody what they wanted to be, and I said fashion designer. Which is crazy to think about. <laughs> like, why did six-year-old me want to do fashion when I literally had no interest in fashion? <laughs> you know, I got all my clothes from Value Village. Oh, this is like, adorable. A beanie, though? I'll give it four stars. It would be five. Take out the beanie. They're only doing the beanie to look available to the poor working class. If I win... Ain't no way. <laughs> okay, I'll do one more round. Yeah, I got last. That's whatever. <laughs> I wasn't trying. I'll do one more round. Because I'll be honest, this game is kind of fucking boring. How was the first one K-pop? Well, it's like Western, I guess. I like it. It's cute. Hi, Cole Bobo. Can we get some yos? Hello. I'm only playing Roblox for today. This is not an everyday thing. You know, chat was begging for Roblox, and you know what? I did it. Now you guys can't say that you're hate watchers anymore. I think this is my favorite pose. No, not this one. This one. It shows off my muscles. Oh, I can sit here? <laughs> What's the theme? Wait, I didn't see the theme. Tea party. Oh, everybody's gonna go for that poofy dress. They're all gonna do it. I'm gonna stand out from the crowd. Doesn't the rabbit have like a red suit? Hopefully they know what I'm going for, a Cheshire rabbit. Gold buttons. Red suit. Wait, I can look up the, the rabbit. Alice in Wonderland rabbit. He has a red coat. Gray pant. 
Yellow undershirt, that's kind of wild. I need some slacks. Are there really no slacks? These all look blue. Okay, this looks stupid. <laughs> Did I just go with the dress? Should I? Oh, it's so much money anyway. A thousand dollars, bro. You know what? Screw it. We're meta gaming. Oh wait, I need the umbrella. I need another top three. That is what I need in this world. You know, all the five-year-olds playing this? They just want to see somebody in a cute fit. What, you guys did an unofficial piece and meetup? That's kind of crazy. Wait, did you guys actually? in Roblox. <laughs> you know, I can see the value to online relationships, but <laughs> hanging out in Roblox is probably not how I would spend time with my friends. We would play Mario Kart, obviously. change the color of the poofy sleeves. <laughs> Guys, should I play Roblox Everyday Type 1? Wait, they went for Alice. That's so smart, dude. I'm so bad at this. I think I'm just not too creative. In in this avenue, I guess. I kind of want to get tights. It's going to be very cold. They should let me, like, change the opacity. No, I hate it. Maybe I just hate clothing. Oh my god, that's literally so good! Why am I always first? tried my best. <laughs> Sorry, of course you get somebody vlogging. <laughs> Why? 
Whoa, this is kind of crazy. I know they're going for Mad Hatter. The boots, a bit much. But still, that's a really cool composition. Also, I'm changing the pin check, so we're no longer doing the challenge. Okay, this person also went for something really basic, which I resonate with. Three stars. That is lovely. I wear so many patterns in my day to day. I think this game is just very overwhelming at the start. Like if I if I grinded this out every day and learned metas and learned different options within, I think I would slay. Every day. Honestly cute. stars because I think the tights are too dark it pulls all your eyes down which is bad I, I saw that in a Twitter post outfit should drag should have your when they look at you it should make them look up towards your face honestly this was cute it's Alice oh my god Okay, if I win, then that just goes to show you just need a dress. Okay, I didn't win. <laughs> Let's see. I got seventh. Damn. <laughs> okay, well, I think that's all the dress to impress I want to play. I understand the appeal to it, but it's just not for me. I like games that have the more you play, the more you get out of it, but this... The most you can build up towards buying new clothes, and it's kind of like not worth it because it takes forever to grind up money. But I get why people like it. Not for me, though. That was just to impress. And before anybody asks, I'm not going to play again. Unless they get like a piece in skin, then maybe I'll do it. Well, guys. That was what the majority of what I had planned for today. Surprisingly, I beat the game relatively quickly. Or I got a win kind of quickly. Still not really sure how. But don't worry, stream is not over yet. Let's do a little bit of daily games. What about a subathon today? <laughs> today? What would you offer me if we did- wait, if we did a subathon? <laughs> Thank you for redeeming, Kim. Oh, play it during a subathon. Oh, okay. Kinda like how you guys were begging last time. Oh my god, what is this sap? It's sap time, everybody. I'm gonna grab my headphones. Man for sap. Okay, I think I'll do that now actually. So I was meaning to make a stream elements command that has all my pet accomplishments in it, that way I don't have to like open my Google Drive.
I spelled ribbons wrong. I put robins. Okay. Let's see. I get ant. Ant eater. Beta. Fish. Of course, I got a blowfish win. Bluebird. Camel. Oh, yeah, we got the cricket win last time. Did I get a deer win? Oh, yeah, I think I want to go for a deer win today. the fish. I thought I didn't have it yet. Giraffe. So that's the list of all the pets that I have level 3 ribbons in. My goal is to get one a day. Okay, a new pack activates tomorrow. Don't want to do that though. Let's see. I haven't gotten mosquito. Still mosquito so I live. Freeze the pig for next turn. Because we'll either go for any of these pet wins, depending on how many spawn. Oversized arms, because they're muscly. One of the weirdest trends I've seen across TikTok concerning streaming is that so many people okay i got a pigeon and mosquito i think i'll go for a mosquito win because the pigeon if i buy it i get breadcrumbs or sell it i get breadcrumbs enter going for a mosquito win anyway a trend that i see is that people will post about streaming before they start streaming so they'll be like, day one, I'm setting up my stream. And they'll do that for like a month and then start streaming. And then they'll get a decent influx of first time viewers in their first few streams. But the problem is, they're only like other streamers. <laughs> it's so funny. Ooh, selling a pigeon? Buying the worm, of course. So I'm going to the pigeon, getting the swan. Nice. And we'll freeze the meepo to give to the mosquito. Oh, I should have put the mosquito in the front anyway. Because I'm kind of in the boat where I didn't post until I started streaming. But looking back, I should have been making Tic Tacs before I click Olive. Okay, no way I won. They had a dolphin. Mm. 
two swans. I'll freeze the swan, level up the mosquito. Camel! That's insane. Lay lucky. And next turn, we'll combine the swans. Oh, I forgot to put mosquito in the front again. I guess the fish would have taken it out anyway. Okay, this is not looking good. Uh... Garlic to the camel? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, we win. I got so lucky getting the camel there. Combine the swan, get a level two. Oh, a deer. Shoot. A deer is good. But now it kind of makes the swan pointless. Because it's better to have a rabbit and worm combo than a swan combo. Ah, uh, shoot. Let's sell the fucking swan. God damn it. Rabbit. I want the deer. Freeze the worm. Reroll. And turn. Man, that was a waste getting this one. But it's okay. The deer is more valuable. Lucky. Okay, I definitely need to clear out the spaces here. No good pets. Ooh, scorpion, nice. <laughs> I honestly need to clear up more spaces for the mosquito to spawn, so we'll buy the rabbit. This run is not going good, but we'll see. Ooh, it could be worthwhile. You know what? Sell the deer. Since we got the rhino, I'll take that instead. Cupcake, that way for sure. He's strong. We'll do this. And turn. This is just so I'm going to have a bit more offensive team. Because the 1013 rhino is more valuable than the deer at this point. The deer is good once you get it to like a tier 2, because then you get a 10 10 buzz. Yeah, if I just want to at least survive, I needed the rhino there. 
Thank you for the mosquito. A meat bone to the rhino is more valuable. Freezing the chocolate, redeeming this apple. Because I don't know which pet I want I should give the chocolate to. Yeah, we got one heart, five trophies. Mushroom isn't really valuable to give to anybody. Level up the camel. At this point, I need more offensive builds. So we're selling the rabbit, buying the snake. Because every time the rhino attacks, it'll deal additional rock damage. And we should give the mushroom... No, I'll keep the mushroom frozen. Chocolate to the worm? Mammoth is good too. Give plus two plus two. We'll freeze the mammoth next turn. We'll sell the worm and swap it out for the mammoth. Apple to the rhino. Well, the snake is out. God damn. Okay, selling the worm for the mammoth. Mushroom to the mammoth. Good thing I kept that. Another mammoth. I'll get the apple to the snake. I just want it to live longer. Right, seven trophies. This could work. Maybe, possibly. They thought their hippo would work. <laughs> Freeze the mushroom, it's not valuable to anybody right now, though. Scorpion's kind of nice. I like the scorpion. I would only swap it up for the snake, but I think the snake's more valuable. I was gonna say the only thing that could cook me right now is a summon build, which is what they have. It's partial offensive, partial summon. struggle but I still got eight trophies that's not too bad for a potentially failed run what is this this is super auto pits it's an auto battler card game but it's pets and I really like it but welcome in alien can we get some yo's hello let's see what pets do I have 
I need... I still haven't gotten a duck win. Let's see. We'll go duck here. My emotes that I always flex are gone. You know what, alien? If you tier one, it'll be discounted this month. Or maybe you'll get lucky and you get a gifted. Because they are discounted potentially later in the month. Uh, should we go for another mosquito win? Fuck it. Fuck it. Offensive failures. Everybody watching right now. <laughs> I'm kidding. I deserve that draw. I was too mean. Uh, should we go for a duck win? Yeah, let's go for a duck win. The duck is my least favorite. Because it has no perks in battle. They're so lame. Level up the duck. I don't like any of those. Buying the worm. I don't mind the badger, but it's not my favorite. I don't like how it attacks adjacent pets. Because it attacks your own teammate. That would only be good if it was a camel or a peacock. perk to the cricket just in case it, they, it gets sniped or something. First loss, turn five. That's okay. Maybe I'm coping. Two ducks? Holy. Probably more valuable to freeze or free up more spaces here. really good. Sell the cricket. Let's get another worm. Okay. Nice.
No good pets. Could be valuable to get the rabbit now. I kind of want to swap the peacock for the deer. No, actually... No. I don't want the deer. It's better to just get a chili perk and give it to the peacock later. See. I don't need the rabbit. I'm gonna swap it out for a scorpion. Level up my duck. Now we got a tier 3 duck. Oh my god, a mammoth. A mammoth is more value than a worm? We'll do this. That way when the mammoth dies, it'll also give the scorpion life. I got three coins left. Now I don't gotta grind for the duck anymore, so I could just play normally. I for sure will swap out the peacock for a blowfish or a rhino if that pops up, so I need to level up my camel and my duck. This one's probably gonna be a dub. Oh wait, I forgot to do predictions. May be day. Ooh, lucky! the chocolate. This one might be rough. Oh, okay. I had just enough HP. Mushroom Mammoth. Okay, okay. It's an 8-3 snake compared to a 4 or a 7-7 seven, seven peacock. We're selling that shit. Level up the camel. So now the camel will give plus two, plus four. End turn. We'll see how the snake does. Because the snake being behind the camel is good because it'll gain more HP. Oh. Damn, I wish the scorpion could have taken out the boar. So lucky with my draws today. Okay. For sure, pair to the snake. Freeze the meat bone. Meat bone to the snake. Just so it has a bit more of a punch. Or you could say bite. <laughs> was a draw. Oh, I forgot. I was like, shit, my scorp is gonna kill the- he's gonna kill the mammoth. Oh, 
fuck? That was insane. Okay, um... Well, what to do, what to do... Shit. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Man, that was rough. I don't want that again. Oh, this is fine. We should be able to clutch here. So 33 peacock, though. Seven out of ten. Okay, nobody's close to leveling up. Let's buy the camel. Meat bone won't really help anybody. I can only buy one thing. I should work on leveling up the snake. So because of that, we'll do chocolate to the snake. That way, next turn, I got two free item spaces. Only thing scary is the shark in the back. Lucky. If the duck didn't have the meat bone, I would have lost. Leveling up the scorpion doesn't do anything. But it's still a good way to build a gradual health. Let's level up the snake. Now, whenever the friend ahead attacks, deal 10 rock damage. Reroll. Nothing really good. Just a little bit of this. Another snake. I forgot when you level up, you get another pet. Okay. Or you unlock a different pet choice. I love doing builds where you get like a 15-15 scorpion and then they take out two or three pets. It's crazy. Shit. 15-15 rhino? It's gonna be a 17-17. We still tie. Turkeys are so annoying. Like, in-game and to cook. Let's see. Nothing really good. I got nine coins, so I'll just... I'll buy everything that I had frozen. You know what? Fuck it? No. Fuck it? No. Apple to the camel? Since I don't have a worm this late in the game, it's harder for me to get heals. That's why my HP for my pets are kind of lacking. No, the the chili's gonna take out the scorpion. Oh no, oh no! What turn are we on? Turn 17, goddamn. A mushroom ain't really gonna help nobody. Neither is a melon. Level up the mammoth? Nothing good. Leveling up the camel won't do much, so I'm gonna get the sushi. Give three random pets plus ones. And turn. I still got two hearts left, seven trophies. This run is still good and valid. Scorpion's gonna take out that fucking boar. 
And we have a chance. I have a dream. Mm-hmm. Mushroom ain't good for nobody. I'll keep the camel frozen and clear out my two item spaces. I think I need to keep bulking up the camel. Damn, this opposing build is insane. Almost every summon type creature has the mushroom. God damn. Yeah, there's no way I could have won there. That was crazy. What I really need is the chili. But to whom? Probably to the camels, the best bet. These pets aren't close to leveling up. Let's do sushi. Okay. Last heart, eight trophies. Oh. The parrot behind the turkey is scary. My scorpion had enough health to tank. Oh my god, the chili came in clutch! We're back here. Turn 20. Nine trophies, one heart. This is do or die unless it's a draw. Definitely. Chili to the snake. Reroll. Is Merle worthwhile to level up the camel in this turn? Because the camel will now give plus three attack, plus six health. Okay. I got a win or a draw. As long as we don't get a cracked summon build, this will be a win. Full offensive build, okay. They took out the scorpion. Nice. Damn. I wasn't able to build enough health. Ah, one more. One more. Have I gotten a beaver win? I have not, so I can go for any of these pets. I don't want to go for another duck win, they're so fucking annoying. Plump rockets, no, plump chipmunk, chipmunks. I guess we're going for a pig win. Pig wins are also challenging because similar to the duck, they have no in battle perk. But they have a decent attack to health ratio. They start with a 4-1. So whenever you are able to start giving your pigs food items, they become really powerful. Flamingo 
could be good to get now. Another pig. Sell the otter. Reroll one more time. Okay, we'll get the pig next turn. Bind the worm. It's not worthwhile to level up the flamingo. But before I do this turn, guys, you know what time it is. We're two hours in stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $5.99, just $6. And if you have never subscribed to my channel before, during September, you do get an exclusive discount. You can also link Amazon Prime to Twitch and subscribe for free. Do it now. I just realized it's 80 degrees outside, and that's why I'm, like, sweating up a storm right now. <laughs> Enter. I'm sitting here like, man, it's hot! I look at my temperature, 80 degrees. Lucky. Garlic perk to the pig since its ratio of health is lower than attack. Giraffe is kind of good to get now. Penguin is also good. Sell the beaver. I'll get the penguin this turn because it has like one greater heart health. Camel as well. Yeah, I don't need the giraffe. I'll freeze the garlic so we'll give the garlic to the camel next turn. Nobody needs the garlic. Enter. Man, I'm getting. Why am I getting so many camels? Should I go? I've already gotten a camel win, though, I think. I think I've gotten a camel hard mode win, actually. Damn, melon perk to the blowfish? That's great. But nothing? Against my pig. Leveling up the camel by way this upcoming turn, it will get the penguin perk. Rhino. Selling the flamingo. Rhino time. This is a pure offensive build, basically. Ooh. 
this has got to be a guaranteed dub. With this team, only on turn 8? That's really good. Once I level up the Rhino, I'm gonna sell the worm. I'll sell the worm once I get either a mammoth or a scorpion spawn. Or if I somehow level up the rhino before then. One by one. Halfway there. Five trophies. Be bone to the rhino, of course. I don't necessarily want to rewrite right here, so I don't want to waste. A little bit of that. Two scorpions? My pig might still clutch here, though. Man, double scorpion win. I want to try that. I never get far with it. Do I want blowfish? No, I don't. I don't need the blowfish. Let's level up the penguin. Okay. I kind of growled that. Selling the worm. Purchasing the mammoth. Reroll. And turn. Now this is Dream Team. If I do get a scorpion though, I'll freeze it. That way if somehow I get to one heart, we'll swap up the penguin for the scorpion. Oh yeah, we're winning. Majority of my pets are pretty tanky. <laughs> huh. That's 7 out of 10. Oh, the only difficulty now is going to be... Am I going to get enough pigs in time? I need to free up more space so pigs will spawn. Only worth- only item worth to give to the mammoth is the mushroom. Not worth to give the garlic. more but I need a stinking pig chili perk to the rhino reroll give me a stupid pig 
Okay, right now, since it's turn 8, I need to free up more slots for the pig to roll. So I'm just going to buy these two pets. Dude, if I get another one without a tier 3 pet, I'm going to be so pissed off. Oh. At least my camel took him out. Thank you. Thank fucking god. I would have been so mad if I didn't get a silly little pig. This could be kind of crazy. Parrot to copy the mammoth or snake to attack behind the rhino. Whenever the mammoth dies, it would get plus two to everybody. If I do the parrot, everybody would get a plus four, plus four. Versus snake. Could do an additional five. Both are valuable. I think the parrot is more valuable though. Two random pets plus two, three random pets plus one. Let's do three random. And you know what? In case I draw, we'll freeze the snake in case I the parrot's stupid. Nine trophies, four hearts left. This could be my tier or level three pig win. That was not my level three pig win. That's okay. You know what? I changed my mind. I think snake is more valuable. Scorpion? Oh, do I want the scorpion or the snake? Fuck yeah, I want the scorpion. Wait, isn't this basically the build I had last time, but instead of big, it was duck? Okay, now I can't level up the mammoth, though. That kind of sucks. Three are into pets plus one. Reroll. Okay, here we go again. Nine trophies, three hearts. Let's see how this goes. I now have the scorpion instead of the parrot. Oh, they gave us more health. Okay. That was honestly stupid, because look, my scorpion took out two of you guys. <laughs> oh, this is easy dub. Mammoth, scorpion, camel rhino, and a level three pig. Finally! There we go, that's my my quota for the day. I got a level three win. Where is it? And there it is. It was previously a level three win, but not a tier three. We got the level three pig win, everybody. Finally. Okay, I gotta update my command. <laughs> well, guys. Um, I know short stream. It feels like I've been doing a lot of short streams. But I'll be honest. It kind of feels better to do shorter sessions than longer ones. Just so, like, 
especially on days where we do streams that will be edits, it feels better. Because, <laughs> like, being on for two hours versus three or five plus, you can obviously tell the difference between energy. Okay. Well, don't worry, the stream is not over yet because we did get a redemption. So we get to do calligraphy. You guys know the drill. Subscribe or use your channel points and I'll write your name. The plan for next week. Oh yeah, we also need to decide. I'll run a poll tomorrow on Twitter on if we should do the cycle subathon for bits or subscriptions. I think it makes sense for more bits because the the bit discount is the second week of September. So if we do that, because, spoilers, it's August 31st. The theme for September is called Shape Up September. So I'm going to be playing a bunch of active games, workout games, which does include Wii Fit. So if we do Wii Fit, we might that might become our new daily game. It depends, because in order to capture on the Wii, you got to swap out the capture cards, and it's kind of annoying. But that might become our new daily game. So, depending on when we do the Cycle Subathon, Shape Up September will be like a week or a week and a half of active streams, either before the Cycle Subathon, if it's bits, because the bit discount is in the middle of the month, or at the very end of September. But honestly, let me actually find the tweet that has the actual date for the bit discount. That way I can look at a calendar. What do you guys think? Bonus bits from September 12th to September 17th. Wow, that's five whole days. Wow. What time though? So September 12th at 10 a.m. to September 17th at 12 a.m. So midnight that day. So from Thursday the 12th to basically Monday night. So we could do... Because tomorrow I have to do follower journal calligraphy and then drawing Kim's portrait because they were the top gifter during the subathon. We'll do that tomorrow on stream. And then Labor Day, I don't know what I want to do yet. On the 3rd, I have a doctor's appointment. Maybe we can do the cycle subathon either on Saturday the 14th or Sunday the 15th. Because I want to do it during a weekend. And since I didn't hang out with my friends on this weekend, we'll probably hang out on the 7th. So, I think, honestly, we can do a poll in chat, and then I'll also do a poll on Twitter. How do I do a poll? Now, you guys can still vote, but this is primarily for those who would consider donating during that stream. Do you want it to be for bits or subs? I personally think bits is better because bits are cheaper. And I think one bit or 100 bits equals one minute makes sense versus one sub equals five minutes. Because let's be honest, if somebody gets goes crazy and puts the timer at like six hours, I will die. I prefer bits. Because just based on how many donations I get through a normal month, I get more subs than bits. But if Vic is there for that stream, I feel like they would go crazy if it were bits. But I don't know. It's hard because, like, it'd be different if I was, like, a 100-viewer streamer 
to where I get guaranteed donations no matter what I do. But these subathon type streams are something that is entertainment for you guys and then uh, entertaining for those who have disposable income, let's say. Okay, we had one vote for bits. I honestly think it makes more sense to do it for bits. So, plan is simple. September, Shape Up September starts not tomorrow, but let's say on the fourth Wednesday, we'll do exercise games. Not necessarily every day, because let's be honest, I will die if I exercise every day. But the primary theme will be exercise games, which will be Switch and Wii games. And then on either the 14th or the 15th, day to be determined, because... I'll do it on, on Friday, or sorry, I'll do it on Saturday the 14th if I feel, like, fit or healthy. But if, like, if I can't do shit on the 14th, then I'll do it for sure on the 15th. So that weekend. That means we'll have, like, four to six streams of, like, fitness games. And if this goes well, I'd be down to do this every year. What do you guys think? Type one if it's a good, good idea so far. Sorry, I was just scrolling Twitter. <laughs> I, I forgot I was on camera. <laughs> uh, guys, it's cool like every time. <laughs> short stream, short stream. But guys, there's guys, there's a new YouTube video. Dude, I'm so tired. It sucks because like my sister will get home from work kinda early. So she'll be knocking on my door too early. Because she likes to use my bathroom. Which. You guys want to hear something crazy? My roommate's at work. So he's not going to hear me. So I have one housemate. That we don't interact with. Because they're like in a separate section of our unit. We kind of have it blocked off. He doesn't wash his hands. That's whatever. You know. Ill men. Wait. I think I had an emote. It, there's an emote called M word. I'll I'll add it later. But anyway, so my roommate went on a trip a few weeks ago, right? I noticed when they were gone, these little sticky things on the bathroom counter because we have two bathrooms upstairs. So we have my bathroom and my room, and then a shared one. So I use the shared one because it has a tub. So anyway, when he's gone, I noticed the sticky substance on the counter. So I'm I'm like, what the fuck? I start picking at it. And it's, they're, like, all over the counter. Because you can only see it when it reflects the light at a certain angle on the counter. So I pick at it. And you know what it is? It's used pimple patches. And I'm like, oh my god, what the fuck? Because it's, like, on my hands. So I'm, like, freaking out. I get some gloves, I clean the counter. So I tell my sister, I'm like, are you fucking doing this? And she's like, no, it's not me. Why would I do that? And I'm like, yeah, it has to be our other roommate. So, he gets back from the trip. That night, I see a new pimple patch on the counter. And I'm like, I'm like, I can't do this shit. Because I can understand, like, having your room messy. But in a shared space, you have to keep it clean. You have to. And, like, to me, leaving pimple patches on the counter is like leaving dirty band-aids or, like, tampons on the counter. Like, that's body matter. Like... That's pus, that's potentially blood, right? So, me and my sister are like, dude, how are we going to tell him? How are we going to tell him? <laughs> so, we wait like two days. And every day there's a new one on the counter. So, we're like, hey, man. We noticed this. Was this you? And he's like, no, I don't know. Was it your sister? I'm like, I look at her. I'm like, was it you? And she's like, no, it's not. And he was like, and I asked him again. I'm like, like was it you? Like, it wasn't me or my sister. Like, it has to be you. And he was like, yeah, I guess, like, I do that sometimes. And I'm like, bitch, there was, like, 20 on the counter. And the moment you came back, there was more. And he's like, yeah, sometimes it's, like, hard to take off the counter when I put it there. I'm like... I'm like, what? 
but keep in mind, my roommate, he's my sister's friend. He's very much... Now you guys cannot tell him if we have another roomie stream. He's very much like a little bitch. Like his parents still cook him meals. They drop it off at our place every day. They used to do his laundry, but now he does his own laundry because I showed him how to do laundry. His room isn't messy, but it's very like musky. How old is he? Same age as my sister. 23. No, wait. No. Yeah, 23. 23. But it's really frustrating because he'll do stuff that's like whatever and that's kind of untidy or unclean. But if you call him out on it, he will deny it. Like a little kid. So you have to like break him down. But anyway. After we told him to stop, he has stopped. It's been three days and still no pimple patches. But still, it's like, what the fuck? Should I make a Reddit post talking about this and get thousands of likes? Type one. Anyway. My main point being, I don't care if your room is messy. But if we're going to be in, like, the kitchen or the bathroom, you keep that shit clean. Like, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm setting up the camera. Good thing he stopped. Yeah, I'm just like, what am I going to do if he does it again? Like, I'm not his mom. I can't yell at him. <laughs> I can't smack him around. You know what I mean? I mean, I could, but then his dad would kick us out, so. Like, I don't mind if shit is, like, untidy, but if it's, like, a, like, unclean in that meaning, that is actually dangerous for me. Like, I can't get sick. Like, I learned the other day that I stopped donating plasma. I talked about this before. But I had to stop because it could make me immunocompromised in the future. Because my condition makes me, um produce or i produce the right amount of protein because my brain will suck up some protein in my body so in the future it could lead to protein deficiencies so me donating plasma isn't the best thing to do because obviously when you donate plasma you're donating protein if you why is it my camera connected mods wait it's not connecting Whoa. Okay, I think I did it right. Yay! I did it. Yeah, so that was the other day. <laughs> like, I get everybody does gross shit. But you know what? At least I keep that in my own room. <laughs> You guys know the drill. Use your channel points or subscribe and I'll write your name. And just a gentle reminder, if you gifted five or more subs during the month of August and you want yourself drawn for the sketch cards, I need those pictures tonight. And if I don't get them in time, that's okay. We'll just draw them next month. Because I didn't give you guys ample heads up because I forgot. But yeah, I said this the last stream because I thought... Yesterday would be the last day of August, but I would like to thank you all for watching. We are wrapping up summer. Finally, it'll be cooler and more chill, so I won't overheat. But August was really fun. We had the subathon in Stars in Time full playthrough. A bunch of one-off games, a bunch of one-off streams, some good YouTube videos. Can I do a photo of me and Mag? Yeah. 
It'll just have to be a different one, right? But this goes for anybody. If you want to do somebody in a portrait card that's with you, just make sure you ask them first. But Kim, we'll still do your ink portrait tomorrow on stream with the first picture you sent me. Do we have anybody else who wants their name written? Redeem now. Max mom loved me. Aww, I'm really glad to hear that. You know, I understand that long distance can be hard. But it's always really nice when there are individuals who will gladly support it, you know? I could never see myself doing it. But I admire those who can have love that was, I mean, care. <laughs> that can, um, <laughs> that can, that can. Okay. I think I'm just getting warm. I'm serious now. I think it's really cute when people have relationships that are loving and caring that can withstand. I almost said withhold. Who said I love them? <laughs> I was like, um... no, that, that's your guys' own prerogative. Anyway, guys, <laughs> I'm going to go now. Another reason why I'm ending stream early is because Ludwig is streaming today with Sea Dog Bay. I'm sorry. You know, I'm a streamer, but I'm a chatter at heart, okay? Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Any chatter circus, I hope you had fun. Maybe one day I'll enjoy Dress to Impress. Whenever I have, like, money to, like, buy all the upgrades, then I'll play Dress to Impress. But thank you for watching. If you want something to watch right now, new YouTube video that was published this morning, I turned 25, did my personality change? Click the link to watch it now. Anything else? I will be live again tomorrow. Time to be determined. But it will be writing all the followers we earned during the month of August and then drawing top gifters for August. No be live now. Nope. Sorry, bitch. <laughs> Hi, Ethan. Can we get some yo's? Dude, Ethan, you literally missed the one time I'm going to play Dress to Impress. You're a fake fan. Imagine not having noties on. I was doing Poplio Community Day. You're such a nerd. <laughs> okay. Well, guys, I'm gonna go. Probably rest a bit. It's really warm. I did not think it was gonna be this hot today. Wait, I have a question. You guys have to be honest. Is Burger King worth it? Because I have coupons. And I kind of want to try Burger King again. But I also don't, because I don't want to spend $8 on it if it's shit. Burger King is nasty. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. But allegedly their chicken is good. And you guys know I have to stop eating beef. It's good only with coupons. Okay, maybe next week I'll try it then when I have a little bit more cheddar. I've only had Burger King once, and that was the time on stream, and it was mid as shit. You worked at a Burger King? Uh-oh. This is- wait. 
No, the chicken fries were ass. They were horrible. I tried those on stream. There's a YouTube video of it on the Clips channel. I actually edited that one. Did you drop food on the ground and put it back in the bag? <laughs> I never did that. The only thing that I did that almost crossed that line was it was at Subway and I dropped a utensil as I was setting up the line. And then I dropped it and I was like, shit. I was about to put it on the food line, but I was like, no, I have to wash this. And then I washed it. Do you want to see a video of the fight that happened in my lobby? Sure. You can send me anything you want as long as it's not explicit, Kim. I gave you permission. Or something that'll traumatize me. Okay, guys, we're stalling. I gotta go. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you tomorrow. Go outside in the sun. It's beautiful out for me. But have a good one. Bye, guys. Bye-bye. You would have ruined not just one meal, but every meal? See, that's what I thought, too. I was like, shit. It's gonna contaminate, like, all the chicken in the line. So I was good, and I rewashed it. Bye, Kim. Bye, Ethan. You know, let's do the outro song early. Any last words for me, guys? I'll be live again tomorrow, probably midday as always. We'll do calligraphy and then drawing Kim. Because they were the top donator during August. Once again, just to thank everybody who donated and supported during the month of August. Thank you to those who tier 1 and resubscribed. We also had those who went above and beyond. We had Computer, Kobobo, Vicanta, Knockback for the gifted subs. Vicanta and Marceline Queen for the bits. Thank you all. Wait, how much? I can actually tell you guys... Wait, do you guys want to know how much I actually made this month? Now, on Twitch, you're allowed to say your total earnings, but not your sub split. I'll leak. I streamed 83 hours this month? What? I ended the month with 63 subscriptions. Total earnings, $181. So no, not enough for the flight. But that's like half the flight. So, shout outs. My sister really appreciates that. Okay. But thank you guys, seriously. And whenever we do go to Hawaii, I promise. Wait, we might not have time to film anything. Shit. We're only going for like three days. Because those were the cheapest tickets we could get. Dude, imagine streaming from Hawaii. Anyway. Bye, guys.